I mentioned, you know, it's it's great that we're seeing um, Hollywood be more open to casting mm. actors of color in roles that were perceived as white. Is there any any kind of existing characters out there you're like, you know, I'd really love to see a black person play that character? James Bond. James Bond. Okay. And I would like to play James Bond. <laughs> <laughs> so you're not you're yeah, not I'll just No, that is for me because that's a role that I grew up, grew up with. I watched all the movies with my dad. He introduced mm -hmm. them to me and I would he had them on VHS like years ago like taped off the TV. And I, like each holiday, I would sit and I would watch all of them, right from Doctor No all the way through. And you know, it's an amazing character. It's so much fun. It's a great British export. Yeah. And it would be, you know, it would be a dream to be able to be a part of that in whatever capacity, maybe. So that's definitely like a career goal for that's me. That's the dream. So that would be you awesome. got time. I mean, because, you know, Daniel Craig was like 45 when he was cast originally. And you know, these are my so favorite got... movies of the Bond movies that they've done because they've taken oh, yeah? in such a different direction from Pierce Brosnan, who was uh -huh. before. And those are really fun and you know kind of glamorous. Kinda goofy, yeah. I mean, sort of. It went in a in. They're not, a little over the top. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. But people were enjoying that, yeah. and they kept going At the with time. it. I love Casino Royale. I think is my favorite. That is of my all favorite of them. Bond movie too. It's I love like it. they took it back to the roots. It's just a brilliant film, mm -hmm. you know. Regardless of the franchise, it's just a fantastic film. Yeah. And yeah, Daniel Craig has been great.